My supplies include the gel press 8x10 printing plate, uh, some acrylic paints, a sprayer and a water spray bottle. I'll just remove the printing plate from the packaging. So I pull the top layer of acetate off and replace that back into the container, put that to the side and here's my plate. I'm starting with purple, so this will form the back of each of the little flowers. So I just want a nice layer of solid colour off this. And I'll let that dry. So now that this side of the paper is dry, I'll start on the other side. I've just put less paint on this time. I want a patchier look. There we go. All of those gaps will be filled in with the other colours. And now a very light layer of pink. And now this last layer is great if you've pulled some prints that are a little too intense in colour and you want to tone them down a bit. So just a, a light layer of uh, cream or white paint. Very pale. And then just a light spritz of, of water. lovely and pastel. Okay, so what I've done here is uh, use a flower dye. This one's by Magnolia and I've cut out a bunch of these uh, shapes. So you can see they're, they're coloured on one side and then just plain purple on the other. Uh, and because I've used such thin paper, I'm hoping that these will curl up nicely uh, when I shape them. <laughs> 